that? That's great. Mango chewed off her own feet. Are you okay? Oh. No one thought she was going to make it, but I was going to give it my all. Lucky pussy. Hi, pretty girl. The big storm Texas had this year where it shut down our power grids and most of Texas was frozen. Apparently, she was left outside in a cage during all that frozen weather. You're such a good girl. Yes, you are. Everything's going to be okay. Some neighbors went to get her. She looked practically frozen to death. She was so cold and she had frostbite. She actually didn't look like she was alive. And Magnolia Exotic Bird Sanctuary warmed her up and got her to the emergency vet. That's where she was for about three days. They were just trying to keep her alive and get her rehydrated. I don't want you to hurt yourself, okay? I know. The doctor performed the surgery on her little feet to make them a little more even and created like some little boots almost. Everything's okay. I volunteered for the sanctuary and they asked could I help take care of her. She didn't look good when we brought her home. Hi. I thought right away, nope, we're not feeling sorry. We don't have time for that. Slowly but surely, over about a two-week period, she started perking up and making little sounds. Come on, little girl. I put a step right there for you. Oh, who cares about the step when you're as awesome as Mango? Look at you. You're so cool. Mango. <laughs> this never gets old. And every time they took the bandages off, they noticed that it was pink skin and that she was healthy and that she was going to heal. <laughs> Only three holes. Oh my God. <laughs> she does not let anything stop her and she has adapted her movements. Yeah. She's adapted using her beak and her tail to move her little feet up. She's done so much on her own that we haven't had time to feel sorry for her. She'll just talk with me and I'll tell her stories and she'll tell me stories. These birds of ours, most of them are special needs. They've taught us so much about resilience. Buttercup is her motivator. Oh. The minute I brought Mango home, Buttercup just jumped right in there. Oh. Buttercup noticed she was trying to walk, so she'll walk around with her constantly and Mango follow her around. Sometimes they get into trouble. <laughs> Besides gravity, love is the most powerful force in our universe. And when we can love, they experience that and they love back. Yeah. And that's important to us. And I think it's important to them too. That little purring sound that she makes. Imagine that going on for half an hour. She's complete the way she is. <laughs> oh my gosh. She's home. <laughs>